Hi, this is Will Harvey of Finale Inventory. I'm going to give a quick demonstration of uh, how to keep track of stock items that have serial numbers. Beginning from the home page in Finale Inventory, um, we're going to do a little story here where we first receive some items into our inventory uh, with specific serial numbers and then we can sell them to a customer picking exactly which serial numbers we sell to a customer. So the story begins with a new purchase. I'm going to purchase a spinal cage. We'll pretend this is a medical device company and I'm going to purchase a quantity of two of them. So I've created the purchase order. When the shipment arrives, uh, I go into Finale Inventory, click on the Shipments tab, and now I'm going to receive the shipment. This is the period of time when I would look at the serial numbers or scan the serial numbers in, um, or scan the barcode uh, in for the items that I'm receiving, uh, and then specify here exactly what spinal cage serial numbers I am receiving. Um, so I'm going to do that by specifying where, uh, both the serial number uh, and the location into which I'm going to receive it. I'm going to receive it into uh, my container called M102. And the serial number it, for this one is going to be uh, 55. We'll make it short just so we can do a simple example. Uh, secondly, I'm going to do this once again for the second item, and that's going to be serial number 56. Okay, so if I look on this uh, table here, I've now got the one with serial number 55 and just below it, the one with serial number 56. I'm going to receive one of each of those, naturally, because they're serial numbers. Save that. Receive the shipment. Okay, so if I go home and look at my stock now, uh, and specifically look at the spinal cages, down here is the spinal cage 40 millimeter. It says I have three in stock. If I click the turny downy arrow to see the details, the three that I have in stock include one with the serial number 55 and another with the serial number 56. Those were the two that we just received. I actually don't have to demonstrate selling these to a customer because it's pretty much the same process as receiving an item except it's in reverse. It's actually just slightly easier because we can pick among the specific serial numbers that we uh, have in stock when we uh, create the shipment to ship to the customer. So that's about all there is to it for creating items and managing stock with serial numbers.